day, I think three overall, my second, so Saturday, we're staying in this camping site, so I'm going to put all the here information. If you're wondering how much does it cost, it cost 22 50 for two people and caravan with electricity and the showers are for free so you don't need tokens or coins and there are two hair dryers so you're sorted I would say and it's really really huge and nice and very close to the corn exchange where the Edinburgh Air Festival uh, takes place and as you can see we're going to have the breakfast and for me a three lemons because Ah, oh, there was. There was loads of fun yesterday, let's say it that way. <laughs> okay, so, so we're heading and what I can say, I'll definitely put some links down below to other footage of other uh, podcasters or whoever was um, recording or taking the footage. And I definitely recommend you to watch Reese's um, because Seth is even there and it was so, so nice. So I'm so happy that she enjoyed it and I really enjoyed it too. Now, just FYI, if I forgot to tell you something and it's important, I will write it down down below just to like something pops into my mind and I forgot to mention. Also, if you have any questions, I will answer under your comment like reply, but also include it maybe into the, this, this section on the YouTube under the video. Um, so what I'm wearing today, I'm wearing keys sweater, like keys to your door, plural, and uh, you can see my tag, which I really love. So yeah, if you're looking for something to mark the front of your sweater, um, that's that's why I love them. Not only that, but you know, they're pretty too. Um, what else? I'm taking my full of minis hat because people were interested in when I was knitting and I didn't take it to Kylie. So just to maybe show how it looks. Um, it is a little bit rough already. I had been using it for a year and I was taking hiking, work, everywhere. So, much loved. Uh, yeah, so right, and let's have another day. That's my second day overall, it's the third day of Edinburgh Yarn Festival. Uh, knitting community, knitters, and anyone who loves yarn, fiber, spinners, um, they're there. Um, not all of them, although I know you're watching. And uh, But I hope at some stage, if you have never participated in any of those things, and you love knitting or spinning or weaving, 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 I think, yeah, you plan something for the future. No, it's just over there. Um, and it's already a big queue. It's not even, what time is it? Half ten. They let us a little bit earlier yesterday, so I think it's far today too. I think we're in focus. Actually, for me, but it's day three. As you can see, there's plenty of people, and what I'm going to do, I'm going, I'm planning to get poles of yarn because that's way cheaper. Um, but I'm tempted to get something from here, maybe all uh, here. Yeah.
had another purchase and that's it. I have still 10 pounds in my wallet, but no worries, I did a big damage. I hope you enjoyed this one. I hope uh, you enjoyed this video. And until the next one, check the links down below. quick update in regards to travelling information is that from Edinburgh we left around, I don't know, 10 30 I would say. We travelled for two, three hours. We slept three hours in some parking spot, slightly off the road and then um, we end up on the ferry and we're travelling now and it's what time is it now? It's 6.40. AM. So I thought I'll take this opportunity to show you how much of the one of these have I have knitted here. And I know it was a short notice, I haven't even mentioned that, but uh, during Edinburgh on Instagram I posted that if you have five gram minis uh, that we would be awesome to bring it up and do a little swap with me with tags that I got. Um, and that way I can add them or kind of start even Edinburgh. Of these hat. We shall see how it goes. I haven't even counted how many I got. I got some, uh, so I'll show you. Um, I got five from Sticks and Treads. Lovely Jennifer. She said hi to me. It was so sweet, so cute. Can I show you the back? I think I can show you the back. And she gave me really colourful ones. I hope you can see it. I have also information on them. I haven't even read them but I will know during knitting what's what. Love it so much. I went and say hi to Ellie from ha a Craft House Magic and she gifted me those two little ones. Look at this. There's information over the rainbow. So here's the one. I'll show you some yarn. Look at this. She is an amazing podcaster. I love watching her. When I went to Ellie's table and she had a few friends around and we chit chat. One lady gave me this little thing, so let's open up. Ducky Darlings, here her information, hope you can read it. And I got this little, a little bundle of love. Oh, so cute. Thank you so much, Katie. And then a lady was looking for me and I was just browsing through yarn and um, I missed her, but she was so nice and brave and she approached Sebastian when he was sitting in the marquees and she gifted him this and I didn't have a chance to give her a tag. So if you're watching this, I'll let me know because I want to reach out to you. Definitely. Thank you so much. There are more than five grams, I would say. Um, and, they're so, and they're so pretty. Um, so thank you so much. As you can see, I got one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven. And to make a full of mini hat, I need 24 5 grams. So, uh, so I hope you enjoyed that little trip. Whoever uh, was there, I, it was a pleasure to meet you. Thank you so much to those three or four ladies who said hi to me and to those who didn't have a port opportunity to kind of approach me if I was somewhere around browsing through yarn. Really sorry about that. Um, but I hope um, it will be better next year because we're planning to go. Definitely. The whole experience and seeing knit this is just an amazing thing. So I would recommend anyone to go if you can and definitely do Kaylee, Kaylee dance. We shall see are we going to do it next year or not because it's a big demand and I know once you do it there's other people who want to do it too and I heard um, you know people feeling dis disappointed they've never tried it. That's that. I hope you enjoyed uh, this one. Check the links down below if you have any questions let me know and yeah I hope to see you next time. Bye!